Hello, welcome back. I'm Jay Barino. It's the Battle for Middle Earth. We're continuing the good campaign. We're conquering Middle Earth today. There really aren't that many missions left. It really comes down to how long they might take. We have a lot of Rohan here to take over, Southern Gondor to get get after as well. Let's uh let's zoom in and pick where we're gonna go. The darkness must be driven from the lands of innocent men. I'm surprised he still has stuff to say to us at this point. Uh, okay, so let's take Rohan and let's head over as far west as we can right now and start taking some of these out. So uh, we obviously don't need command. I guess it doesn't really matter, though, what order we do these in. Let's get the Even Star powered up as fast as possible. So let's head over there. And we're just going to alternate back and forth which armor we use. Well, I guess it doesn't really matter the order, but I want to make sure that I split the remaining missions to make sure that veterancy is spread as much as possible. Fangorn, the most ancient forest of Middle-earth, is the last home of the Ents, shepherds of the trees. Destroy all Isengard forces! Okay, so there's Isengard here still. There's Isengard here, here still. Disguise? Rally to me. Mount? Keep them at a distance. There may be orcs near. Okay, so these are all my ranged units. Then all of these folks. Plus heroes, etc., etc. Uh, we want to move out like as soon as possible, right? Just look out for pikemen, that's all. Okay, get over there. And it seems like the enemies all start with pre-placed stuff here, and as long as we're, like, on top of that, then we're in good shape. Okay, bunch of wargs, as long as we're, again, once just here and we're... We're blasting them where possible. They have quite a bit of stuff here. I haven't used this glorious charge yet, I really should. Okay, back up, back up. Oh god, my poor peasants. Okay, then they walk in, they get mowed down. It's just that easy. Okay, um... You all stay clumped up, and then we're gonna King's Favor. Okay. And then as usual, let's just get a well and then some farms. That's fine. Okay, he did use he did use it. And I'm just gonna wait and plop down a big heel here too. Okay, my peasants are still alive, don't worry. We do want to get these archers leveled up like as fast as possible, so I think this is acceptable that this is this is how we're doing it. There we go. Okay. You know what? Just you all could just kind of stand near this. Let's head up in this direction. We'll throw down settlements where we wherever we can find them. We can get an outpost here as well and just start creeping up. Keeping an eye out, and then Mary, where are you actually? Okay, yeah, you can be part of my melee group, I guess. As long as I just spread out again, getting these extra veterancy buildings as well. I should be going faster. These, these are my heroes, right? Yeah, yeah, that's that's poor Theoden. I could probably split the direction, or like the order that my, you, like the direction that they're moving in and such. Cause like we have to get my heroes leveled up and we want to get as many squads leveled up as possible. I'm less concerned about the heroes. I feel like getting the heroes leveled up is much easier. Ents, you love to see it. We don't, we don't really need them. Let's check the bonuses. Make contact with the Ents, command your Ents to throw rocks. I can do that. Done. Give me that total victory, baby. 
We must defend our country. What I can do is keep my heroes back here to kill these guys that are coming from this direction. To get them up, to get them leveled up relatively quick. Keep these lands safe. Meanwhile, up here. We go ahead and move in this direction. Right, and again, my heroes are just going to sit down here and farm up XP against these units that are spawning down here. Okay, we know that there are more. We know that there are a lot more on this map. So it, it's it's a very delicate balance between going too fast and going too slow. If you go too slow, there's a chance that you're going to lose units. Where's Mary? Is he is he with them? No, he's just standing here. Follow me! Follow me! Hurry up! But I also need to get Theoden up there in order to give XP to my other units as well. So this is Theoden. I guess why don't you run up here? We really want to be using this as, as fast as possible. Or as, as frequently as, as possible, I should say. It's nice that we're getting Ents, but again, we really don't need or want them. It's it's fine either way. Okay, let's head down here next. Get up here and we'll give XP to this big old ball of units up here. Perfect. Now is the hour. Go with haste. Keep going over there. You've got the Ents to support you. Again, the Ents aren't super necessary to actually win this. Mary's going to really struggle with XP, that's for sure. Keep these lands safe. There's some trolls up here. Maybe we use our heroes to kill the trolls. Let's go, Mary. What are you doing? Aomer's level 10? You'll love to see it. Don't let him rebuild this stuff. I like how they say, haha, we've destroyed them, when in reality, like, they, they're still making stuff. Here, you can just stay away from here. Thayden, where are you? That's why he's not getting any XP. Now, I don't think that this can be used on heroes, unfortunately. Okay, even star power still coming up. All right, and maybe let's get one more usage of King's Favor before we proceed. Where's Mary? So see, they, they, they make like one group of units constantly out of this little area, and I can just sit here and just keep killing these to get my heroes leveled up. I'm not super proud of it, but it is something that I can do. So, like, specifically Theoden. Like, one more group here and it'll work. And then what I can also do, come on up here. Grant more XP where possible. I see some of these groups like these, like this group right here of Elven Warriors is only level 3. That's no good. Okay, and then Theoden, let's secure your level 7 by getting down here, and then we'll go and clean it up. Theoden and nearby troops, 30% damage, 70% armor, and don't slow down while crushing. So basically, we put him as, in as part, of our, as part of our big group. 
and then just as part of our Rohirrim group, and then we just run him in and just mow down everything is the idea here, I think. Seems pretty cool. Have not really used it, but uh, something we want to stay on top of where possible. Good levels on our heroes. We need two... Well, I mean, realistically, we can get the final levels on our heroes on the final mission. So we should probably focus on at least two more missions with Rohan, which I think are definitely available to us. All right, you love to see it. You love to see it. Getting those hobbits leveled up. See, that's not that many. That's not as many as I would have liked. There just weren't that many units on this map, but... You gotta take what you can get, I'm trying to use my heroes where possible. You also want to keep your heroes near your units because they provide that XP boost. But it's kind of hard to do that when you're also trying to get your heroes XP. So, I think maybe I'm, tr I'm thinking... Sauron wages war with all of Middle-earth. He must be stopped, or all shall fall into darkness. I think I might be overthinking it a little too much in the sense that, like, just keep the heroes with the army and whoever gets XP gets XP, you know? Let's go ahead and send Gondor up to the to Wold. I know this is like Rohan's area of expertise, but um, you know we'll send them to the lower act places for now. Uh, a little bummed about this army. I would have really liked some. I mean, I I still have time, sort of, but if I were to build new units in this next mission, it would I wouldn't be able to get them nearly leveled up close to where my other squads would be because some of them are already you know Wold veteran C three four. Land of Rohan. For ages it has been a quiet and desolate place. Destroy all evil Humor. forces. Look for tracks. Let's all evil forces. Quiet. And we're just gonna cycle through and turn stuff the on autocast. The enemy has now grown far. Axe throw. Oh, Gimli got level seven last time, apparently. All right, that's fine with me. We will protect these lands. Okay, get this set up just in case. Be alert. Okay, and then let's go ahead and just move my heroes out to start looking for stuff. Separately, I'm going to move everyone up and clump up because we've got the Boromir, Faramir, Captain stuff. Right, so we can we can upgrade everybody where possible. Oh, and then Legolas also. Come on back here. These guys all need XP, so we'll just let them. We'll just let them go go crazy here. They're fine. Okay, train the archers. Train guys. Train guys. Move together. Okay, that's probably acceptable. Let's go ahead and get down here. <laughs> these, I mean, these two heroes together can pretty much do anything. They're gonna be fine. The enemy could be near. These are all my archers. Plus Boromir. Rangers. Be still. Rangers and archers, turn around. Take care of this stuff coming up from behind. Riders. That's right, we got some Isengard forces here. We must be vigilant. Our friends nice. await. Stand ready, okay, gotta get back to base. If they destroy this, it's really not the end of the world. Though, do I have enough to rebuild it? I don't know how much it costs. Seems like their main force is from the left. We do want to get our knights fully leveled up where possible. Okay, all heroes are in here. This is good. How much for this? Yep, I don't have enough money to actually to actually rebuild my base. That's fine. There's no... I mean, we're not... We don't need a base. If anything is that's been proven, is that we don't actually need a base. We don't. Let's pick a direction, move forward, and see if we can get this done. We can also call in allies if we need help cleaning, you know, whatever up at the, at the end of the day. 
Lithio Ifelin! Men of Gondor! The enemy's encampment! Mustn't let them close. Guard this area. Okay, I heard him say it's the enemy's encampment. It's probably because we just saw this lumber thing here. They won't escape. Good work, boys. Let them close. Be alert. Look for tracks. Okay, well, whatever we're looking for is is here to the left, I think, primarily. Well, they come from all these directions. Kimberly, why don't you stay closer to the front? Because you're the one who's constantly missing out on XP. I don't. It, I think he's because he's a little slower than everybody. Oh yeah, this is what we're looking for. Be calm. No pikes means this is going to be absolutely fine. Does he have that word of power? No, he needs to be level 10 for word of power. We must act quickly. Prepare yourself. Rally together, guys. All right. I think I have some, some groups in here that don't have fire arrows either. That's like a big bummer. They are gone from these lands. The enemy has grown stronger. We must be vigilant. Okay. Gondor must stand. You must be vigilant. You have done well this day. Again, just trying to use my veterancy powers as frequently as possible and attacking with our heroes because a lot of them give us bonuses to the amount of XP that is collected, essentially. I think the knights are fine. So, again, I'm mostly more focusing on my hero levels. The enemy is near. Which I really don't think is a big, a big problem. Let's do this. Okay, keep moving, keep moving. I don't know how much XP that realistically is giving us, so that makes it worth using or what. I'm gonna assume yes. Siege, we Siege weaponry goes down, no problem. Pippin has more XP than Gimli, Legolas, and Boromir all together. <laughs> You'll love to see it. The enemy is upon us, man! And like, I could mount up Gandalf and Faramir, etc., etc., but you know, we don't have to. We don't have to do that. Do not pause. I think moving is a more Conjoined ball of stuff is better. Moving is like one big ball, and then having the cavalry kind of sweep in from the side is necessary rather than necess than just leading with them. But we'll see. Destroy the goblins that invest this territory. That might mean that might mean we're not going to get total victory. That's fine. As long as we get unit veterancy, that's really all I care about right now. That's all we care about. Just victory. Didn't destroy the goblins. I didn't check the bonus objectives. It's okay. This is looking good. These are our two lowest battalions. I hate it. I hate to see it. But everyone else is really getting up there. Ow. The lands of Middle Earth must be saved. See, these, these Act 20s do... They, they are a little spooky. The act, these Act 20s are a little spooky. We'll save those all for last. Act 20, Act 20, Act 20, Act 20. There's a few more Act 14s down here. Rohan, you're up again. Dunharo. Dunharrow has long been a great refuge and rallying point for the Rohirrim. Okay. They could only afford to have him say one sentence. Destroy all Isengard forces? I wouldn't have guessed. Purchase shields? Done. Okay. Men of Rohan, go now. Okay, so Rohirrim, move up here. Eowyn? Theoden? Everybody clump up as much as possible and then give them give them this. May you fight well this day. Quick. This will be a day to remember. 
We all must have a fall. Okay, so this is my this is my Rohirrim group, and then everyone else you're just grouped to. Because you're slow. So this is a timed map, so we want to just go. We just want to go. Or it says prepare for an attack. Goblins, there they are. What should we do? Ready, elves. Let's just do this. Men of the river Get ready. We're under attack. We will win this day. Oh god, my peasants. Okay, tons of wargs. I think we're fine. I think we're okay. It's time for lunch. That's the enemy there. Us hobbits must stick together with haste. Let us Get ready. No, 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 no. Follow my lead. Go with haste. Kill the Just let my archers mow these down. Riders of the mark. Hobbits must stick together. Move forward. The enemy is near. The enemy is near. Did you know that the enemy is near? This will be a day to remember. We are They're just so slow. They're so slow. Riders of the Rinema. Uh, how about down here? Looking good. Let's get up here. Oh. Where, where are you going, boys? They just walked by us. It's just destroy all evil camps. It, it, it was mostly wargs, and again, they ran right by us. That's fine with me. Good. Hit most of those. Never shall they return. Do you think those wargs are gonna ever turn around and maybe try and come and get us? No, is the hour. Maybe not. Ah! <laughs> you love to see it. Well, it said that we needed to destroy all evil camps. The question is, I think we just destroyed their main camp, so where's the rest? It's possible that it's this area right here. Nope, this is just a this is just like a fortress area or an outpost area. I don't know where their main army went. There, here they come, maybe. High level enough archers still just completely mows them down. Nope, that was it. Okay. I think we got a lot of kills on those works as they ran by for XP. Obviously, I could be min-maxing more to get as much XP as possible, specifically on my heroes. Like that, you know, that's an issue, but... It's fine, we're cruising towards the finish. I don't think we're gonna have any problems uh, on the Black Gate once we do get there. Though, again, we do have some pretty low level archer battalions that need to get up there. Like, those elven warriors are great. But as far as I know, they get roasted pretty fast. And pillage the lands of Middle Earth. I think nearly everything everything left is Act 20. We have Southern Athelion here, and we have one... Uh, let's go ahead and send Rohan... ...here.
Rohan's cavalry is in great shape. But their archers are not, where it's kind of the opposite for for Gondor, and Gondor has more heroes. Forest that marks the border between the lands of Rohan and Gondor. This land is rich in resources. The only thing at this point of the game, like obviously this is all optional. Destroy all Isengard forces. But having to go through and like turn all this stuff on every time is, you know, it's annoying. As King of Rohan, I grant you my favor. Okay. Let us ride. We will show our valor. I will blend in with the other horsemen. Men of Rohan. Sha! We will show our Brothers valor. Of the Lord. All right. So we've got all of these folks. Men of the Riddermark. This is my Go cavalry. Our enemy has claimed these lands. Get ready. We've got to do something. And again, just take it's taking the time to ensure that I have my hotkey set up so I don't just like run stuff into hard counters. That's all. Um, obviously I want to keep leveling up as much as possible. I don't think that ultimately is gonna be a big problem. That must be the enemy. Let's check our objectives. Contact the eagles that dwell in this region. Com combine an archer battalion with a peasant battalion. Oh yeah, we could put the peasants onto uh onto some high level stuff. We could certainly do that if we wanted to. That way it'll stop the peasant battalions from getting roasted. Okay, back up here, back up here. Dude, look at the peasants go. That's what they're good at. And look, we stopped them from setting up this outpost. I guess we can grab this to stop them from taking it. Okay, back up here. It worked. Now what I could do in theory is just is get these these statues and then just sit under them as they attack us. And that'll get us a ton of XP. Okay. Yeah, this is looking good. Be ready, Arthurs. And in fact, I'm, I'm leaning towards doing that a little bit here. Let's, again, get clumped up as much as possible. Quickly, please. There you go. So this is what I mean by min-maxing. I don't want to get, like, I don't want to go, like, super overboard with this. I'm just saying I could, if I really wanted to, I could do this. Um, cause we've got them sort of bottlenecked here, and then we have a building that we can use as sort of a... As sort of a thing we can use. And then we can do this as well. Can I? Yeah. And then just sit here and spam King's Favor. I would like to get Thaden up to level se or level 8, rather, for sure here, if possible. Men of the Riddermark. And we definitely haven't lost anything, which is pretty incredible. Uh, okay, so let me let me see if I can find. Like a high level archer squad that exists. Because, like, these guys getting kills, I, I assume that their their XP is spreading out. It's like, this looks good. There you go. So we're, we're combining these so that the peasants won't just create, like, run in like madmen. Hopefully they stay like this. But maybe not. There are more peasants in here somewhere. Stay sharp. 
Okay, this is just a level 10 veteran C squad. This is run there. There's the other peasants. So we can I combine these with I could combine these with an archer with a horse archer battalion too if I wanted to, I think. No, I cannot. Okay. Maybe I can't. Okay, well, I did combine one of them to do that. The other one can remain free. Okay, just keep backing up. Give me that XP here. Back up. We want to engage these near the fountain and near the towers. Near the statues, rather, so that we get a bunch of extra XP. Theoden is here also, which means he's giving us the leadership bonus. Aomer has the same thing. Perfect. See, our level, our level ten, the, the two stars, the two star groups. That's where, that's where things like they just completely wreck everything very easily, actually. Thayden somehow still does not have his next level. He's he's bound to get it soon, right? You know what? You guys just come sit down here, except Thayden, because you're killing you're killing too much. You're killing too many enemies. Mary, come over here, I guess. Okay, Thayden gets his level. I think we could get married to level 9 this time if we wanted to. So this is what when you have a good choke point like this, this is how you, again, just get a bunch of XP for basically free. Now, I can't tell, like, who has been, who has gotten it and who hasn't. Like, who's gotten veteran C and who hasn't, because that's one of the major issues, because you... You could spend a bunch of time here and, and like... It seems like most squads can get one level, and then they continue accruing XP, but it gets to their next level very, very, very slowly. So, I don't know what the, the most ideal way to do this would be. Dude, peasants, let's go. So I think I can only combine them with a Yeoman Archer group, of which I don't have that many, but here, we'll attach you here. It's possible that, I don't know if this will rename them or, or something, I don't think so. It's possible this won't actually stay consistent. <laughs> there they are. Go get them, Mary. Throw rocks. Rocket ship rocks. I mean, he's already halfway to nine. I think on some of these, like, level, t or these Act 20 missions, there's going to be so many units that we just have to funnel them into, like, our archer ball, and everything will be fine. Okay, trying to really clump up here. Like, clump really, really hard here. How about like this? As king of Rohan, I grant you my favor. Yeah, that's what we want. I think we've gotten the levels on pretty much everything that we need. On everything that we need to be getting levels right now. So let's go. You know, Mary not getting a level is not the end of the world. I'm not concerned about that. You've got your spear on. We'll put on Smite. We will have victory. Okay, and let's go and find where these squads are coming from so we can finally get this show on the road. Keep these lands safe. So I don't wanna I don't wanna like do this sort of like semi-crazy min-max constantly. I just want to I wanna pick one specific mission and maybe just try to make sure that we're getting as much as possible in terms of 
In terms of XP, I'm not concerned about that encampment anymore. I don't need it. This looks like where the majority of their units are coming from, so we're going to attack right up there. I think we have one more Rohirrim group, too, that's not super leveled up. It's fine about that castle. Don't worry about it. We're getting rid of these outlying outposts right now. Okay, I think we're good. Just keep going this way again. We're looking for their main bases here. We're fine against the wargs. I think it's time for lunch. Okay, this is clearly like a big encampment right here. Get the Rohirrim in the back to cover us while my archers just mow down this stuff. Okay, and like we're losing like the occasional small group of units, but it's not, it's nothing. I will put an end to this evil. It's nothing major. This was clearly their major encampment. They have some other production somewhere. The enemy is here. Apparently the Rohan outpost shoots arrows. Have they always done this? They've already taken this area. Keep a watchful eye. Set four. That can't be the end, right? We know that they have more production somewhere. Theoden. As king of Rohan, I grant you my favor. Riders of the Riddermark, prepare for battle. Okay. Men of the Riddermark. I guess we'll go up this away. way next. They could be. They they really could be anywhere. Our castle is under attack. I sort of like this in a way where like you've built, you've spent the time building a large force, and now you just like you don't need it anymore. Period. You know, I think that's great. Quickly. Poor poor Mary. He's so small. He takes forever. They clearly have a base over here. Dude, he might get his level from this. And if he dies, then he dies. Like, that's fine. We're too late. They've already taken this area. Away! Get them all! We're attacking! Got him now. Help! Just keep Anybody? doing this till you die, buddy. Then we'll resummon you. It's gonna be great. We must defend our country. Our castle is under attack! I do not fear the creatures of shadow. Oh, we had somebody garrisoned in here. Crap. <laughs> I didn't want to do that. Okay, I guess we'll get Mary back here instead. So they have... They have a variety of bases somewhere. Now is the hour. Now this is fine because again we're getting just a ton of XP from all of this, which is like all I care about at this point. Follow me. Okay, keep it up. Dude, the peasants were protecting the elven archers. The land is full of dangers. Stay here, buddy. Okay, that's another base down. We know there's something over to the left. 
the land is full of you know what? Go, go melee, dude. Take him out. Dude, look at him go. He's a god. I mean, yeah, he's covered by the towers and stuff, but... Back off, fiend. This way. Yeah, you hear that? Back off, Quickly. fiend. Dude, get healed. We have to do something. Gather your weapons. We must defend our country. Go with haste. <laughs> they just keep get coming. That's right. Get him up to level 9, baby. He's gonna get it. Get ready. Okay, maybe not. It was close though. He'll get it next mission, no matter what. I do not fear the Did you know they've already taken this area? Here, come down and kill these worker, these worker orcs. I guess. The land is full of dangers. He's chasing these poor guys, trying to cut down trees. Dude, come on. Oh my gosh. It's the enemy. Get away. Take cover Over there. There. Get away. Quickly. All right, that's enough. Let's go. <laughs> the thing is, when he gets, when he ticks to level nine next mission, doesn't that mean that he's not gonna, um, be able to get to level ten because the progress slows down so much after getting one one level? Get ready. I think maybe we can get it for him when we push into this last base. Let's go. We ride. He should leech enough XP to get it. But maybe not. Because I don't think buildings actually give you XP. In any case, this is going to end the mission. It's fine. He and Thaden both should be able to get level 10 on it at the very latest, the Black Gate mission. I'm really happy with my Rohan army. It's fully upgraded. My Gondor army, on the other hand, I like the composition of it a little bit more, but at the same time, I have archers that don't have fire arrows, and I can't really do anything about that. We didn't contact the eagles. Yep, that's what we want to see. Not total victory, but it might as well be. We left the Eagles in peace. We're getting up there. One Elven Battalion's not looking too hot. Yeah, here we go. Okay, so they're combined. Dude, level 9! Apparently, I turned one of these into a Battle Line Battalion. They can probably get turned back uh, at this point, but... Dude, level 9 and level 8 Peasant Yeoman Archer Battalions. The issue is, I, did I... I think I may have, cha like, accidentally changed their names. Especially, like, we had Black Frost Squad, didn't we? And Black Frost Squad is now gone. Black Frost Squad is now going to be... Um, is going to be this Elven Warrior Battalion. We can do Black Frost Battalion. It didn't fit, right? Yeah, it didn't fit. So you're going to be Black Frost Squad. And then this peasant, this is going to be the least of gods. And then this, no, 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 no. This is um, Warner Brothers DMCA. Okay. Uh, I'll have to go back and double check to see if I lost any of my other names. I may have lost a second Yeoman Archer Battalion name. I remember Black Frost Squad, and all we're going to do, we'll just, we can rename it the Rohirrim Battalion or something like that. But otherwise, again, our armies are getting where they need to be. To be fair, they're probably already where they need to be. Darkness must be driven from the lands of innocent men. Okay, so then we've got Anorian. And then all these level 21s. How about this? How about... 
How about we end now and come back next time is what I was thinking. Maybe two more episodes of cleanup and then the Black Gate is my thought. Again, these missions go very fast unless I'm trying to really eke out XP, which I am. I do want to do that. But there's just there's a lot of there's a lot of options, a lot of ways to do that. And you can choose to grind or not. I think at the end of the day, as long as we get most of our squads, or if we can get every squad above level 7, I'd be really happy with that going into the last mission so that we can completely smash it. And uh, yeah, thanks everyone for watching. I'll see you next time. Peace.